What's up Xiaomi fans, Christian here, welcome back to All About Me. I have here the Mi True Wireless Earphones 2 Basic, which is the global version of the Mi Air 2 SC. Let's see if it is any different to the Chinese version. Let's get rolling! And I would like to thank Xiaomi for sending this uh, product over. Right, so unboxing this, we will have the following items. So we have the charging cable, which is type C, and we also have the international version of the manual. And of course, we have the charging case, which allows, um, which charges it for extended 20 hours battery life. And also we have uh, the earphones. So we have uh, the, the two earphones. And I've received a few feedback uh, from my previous video on the Mi Air 2 SE that they find it quite thick. Um, so far, it's quite light. Uh, I don't mind the design at all. Uh, it's, it's a preference actually. So uh, later I'll show you how thick it is, how long the, uh, what are the dimensions of this, of this earphones. And uh, we have all the speakers and all that. Uh, it's quite neat, it's handy, it's, it's light. We have the light indicator in the front, which lights up if you're charging it and or if um, um, when you when you're pairing. And we have the Type C connector for charging this um, case itself. And it has a magnet to keep it keep the cover sealed. The magnet is not super strong, but it keeps it closed. Its weight is 48 grams, its impedance is 32 ohms. Connectivity, it's using Bluetooth 5.0 with a charging time of 1.5 hours, which also supports uh, audio codec, SBC, and AAC. The range is up to 10 meters, which is if it's open space, and the battery life for the earphones itself is up to 5 hours, and the total battery with the charging case is up to 20 hours. And the earphone standing length is 4.3 cm, so which is pretty long, it's quite visible, and its thickness, the diameter is 1 cm. So you, you might be saying that it's pretty thick, uh, it's kind of like, it, it, it depends on your preference actually, I'm, I'm okay with this. And at the bottom you will see the two microphones with noise cancelling for calls, so recording it doesn't have noise cancelling. And it's pretty handy with the case. Uh, aside from its magnetic cover, the earphones itself is actually secured because it's magnetic. So once you charge it, uh, there's a light indicator there that will blink if it's charging. And uh, it's quite neat. It's, it's, it has a minimalist design. And pairing with my Mi 10 is now easy. So there is a pop-up connection. So once you open it, ask you to connect and it just follow the instructions it will just connect within less than 10 seconds so you're all good to go also after connecting you will see uh, the battery life for each of the earphones and also the charging case itself and if you want to set the or the audio codec you can actually go to um, the bluetooth settings there's an on and off with AAC by default it is on SBC and here's a sample of the sound quality.
All right, putting it on, it's quite easy. I like the fit on my ear. It doesn't drop off, so I, I find it comfortable. It's light, so I barely know that it's even there. Not unless I'm, I'll be playing music. So you just have to double tap on the right side if you're in a pause play or you want to end a call or answer a call. And double tap on the left side if you want to activate your voice assistant from the phone. And one cool feature of this is the wear detection. So basically, if you remove it, it will automatically stop the music. And if you put it back on, it automatically plays your music. And here's what I think. First of all, I think that the price is actually quite affordable. I'll be putting a link on the description. You can check out the price. And uh, the sound quality is amazing. And it is easy to pair, especially with the uh, pop-up function when you're pairing it with uh, most of the MIUI phones. I haven't tried other phone models, but I've tried it on my Mi 10. It works. But the only downside is the design. So it's quite debatable. Maybe some of you doesn't like the design. I had some few comments when I had the review for the Mi Air 2 SE. They find it bulky, but I mean, it's quite worth it getting this de device itself. So let me know what you think. You can leave it down in your comments below. And if you do like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you on the next video.